welcome. Here at Bad Food Blog, we take your concerns seriously. That is why today's episode has better lighting, better sound quality, and you can see my full head. Now I understand yesterday was just a tech demo, really, of the quality of this, my new face. As you can see, I have cute ears. I uh, even removed the piercing, which was actually a label uh, here on this ear. But I don't even think you got to see that. We, we're committed to making the best, worst food program we possibly can. And to do this, we need you to share the program. We also need you to watch. Today's program will be on how you can... This is going to sound awful. You can cook potato waffles in a toaster. Now this is serious. I'm going to have the potato waffles with ramen noodles. And I'm going to show you that I'm going to cook them only using the power of a toaster. Isn't that fantastic? Yeah! Okay, let's get on with the video. I'm not going to sit here and do the whole thing like this. You can hardly see. I, I need to switch over to the smaller camera, the handheld one, and show me putting the things in the toaster and doing all sorts of other stuff. I might dance my way out with some Christmas carols while we get the rest of the stuff ready. There we go! So welcome, here are the potato waffles I will be cooking in the toaster. I hope you can see that, they are bird's eye potato waffles, there are 10 of them in the pack, I've already opened the pack, and uh, let's begin. The process is relatively simple, you put your hand in the box, you uh, take out two potato waffles, you uh, just drop them, as the frozen pucks they are, into there, and uh, you begin. You just toast them again, and again, and again. So, I recommend three times. If you have a frozen button, this is good. Now, people believe that this is a temperature dial on toaster. This is not a temperature dial, it's a timer. Toasters always work with resistance metal, okay? They work by passing an electric current through metal, converting 100% of the energy used into heat. So therefore, a toaster, like a uh, like many other things in your house, which uses electricity by resistance heating, is 100% efficient. In fact, it's the most efficient device you'll ever own. There are some crumbs on top of this, and I really should have cleaned this before doing this. But yes, it is now working. And it'll take probably about five minutes. So I'm not going to sit here and film all of this. We'll cut back to this when it's done. Thank you very much. The moment of truth has arrived, they are ready. Now I'm going to use plastic tongs to take them out, not metal ones. I am going to turn the toaster off, safety first. I'm going to reach in and grab them. And here they are. As you can see, they are crispy. They are toasted, they are cooked as if they've been in the oven. They went down three times, first one on defrosted, the next two times about, and they're golden brown. That is the laziest way to cook a potato waffle that has ever been created. And genius. You put the ramen in the microwave. You put it, put it, put it. Two minutes. And of course, for the final preparation, the noodles on top. <laughs> Yummy. Bird's eye potato waffles and ramen noodles. I like mine with a little bit of sauce and the potato waffles will soak a lot of that up, but I think it's really yummy. Thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe.